so Garvey's totally just staring her down, and she's all like, you're there sitting in my mom's chair eating my dad's delicious chicken, uh? Uh, it wasn't my mom's chair. Okay. And Nora, who I am now on first name basis with, by the way, she's all like, go ahead. I don't give a shit. Look in my purse. And I'm like, damn, is she bluffing? Because obviously Garvey's supposed to just be like, oh, sorry, no, forget it. But no, fuck that. Garvey grabs her purse, looks in that shit, and no gun. <laughs> I don't get it. Why does it matter? Because she's lying. It wasn't in her purse, but she still has it. How do you know? Because I know. What's that got to do with the gun? Absolutely nothing. Garvey is just cock blocking her dad. She was pretending. Pretending what? To be OK. She lost her entire family. Just so you know, it is possible for some people to be OK, Jill. Are you OK, Amy? Okay. I am fucking fantastic. And I gotta say, I think your dad would be too if you just fucking let him. Guys, let's just calm down. Come on. Did you fuck him? Whoa. Hey. What? Let's play ping pong. Yeah. Okay. Guys? Did you? Did you fuck my dad? Yeah, Jill. I did. I fuck your dad. And I felt really bad about it. So I was like, hey, Mr. Carvey, this is so wrong. But he was like, hey, let's stop pretending to be OK, because no one is OK. And he was totally right. And he was so hard, Joe. So I fucked the shit out of him on top of a pile of guns. Fuck you. Fuck you.